Black C3 family. It's always a pleasure for the returning viewers and for the new viewers, we're glad to have you. As always, please hit the like and subscribe button and the Fresh Prince of Bel Air notification button if you'd like to be notified. Real quick before we get started, just remember this is not financial advice. We're not financial advisors. This is just for educational purposes. So today we're gonna to be going over how to transfer assets from any sort of Binance wallet to your new Binance Smart Chain wallet extension in your browser. So we're gonna be transferring XVS because we're stoked on the airdrop that's happening on May 15th. This will allow us to receive 1000 VRT tokens per one XVS token. So with that being said, let's jump right into it. So for demonstration purposes, I'm going to be using pancake swap to show you guys how to transfer XVS tokens from your current wallet or possibly an exchange where you might have it. We're going to be transferring ours from our swipe wallet on the Binance Smart Chain to our new newly created Binance Chain wallet. This will make us eligible for the XVS airdrop on May 15th. We will be receiving 1000 VRT tokens per one XVS. So this is really great news, just more free tokens, more free money. So with that being said, uh, first step is actually figuring out what your address is and where you're gonna be sending these tokens. So like I said, I'm using PancakeSwap as a an example, the, my recording program won't let me pull up my actual uh, extension up here in my browser. It just kind of ghosts out. So anyway, this will allow me to show you guys what I'm doing. So what I'm going to do is connect my Binance Chain wallet. And just like that, I have my address right here. So I'm going to copy this address. And you can also go to view on Binance Smart Chain Scan, which is the same thing as Etherscan, and this will basically pull up your wallet address showing you what you have. So at the moment we have a few Dodos and some Venus. So right now we're gonna send the rest of our Venus over. So I will be doing that from my phone. So I'm gonna need to figure out where to send it, which we did up there on our here up BSC scan. So I'm gonna send the wallet address. I'm gonna send all. Oop. Looks like we're trying to send a little bit more than what we have. Make sure that our addresses match up. Look at the first five letters and numbers and the last five. Make sure they add up. Just double check. All right. Confirm with Touch ID. Now our transaction is in the process. So here in a few minutes, this should show up right here. In the meanwhile, some really great news on Ethereum, just crushing all time highs right now. At around 3308, we saw a nice peak up over 300 or $3,341. Pretty crazy right now. This is a great sign that DeFi is about to run. So I'm gonna check back in with you guys here in a couple minutes. I gotta let this transaction process through, so. All 
All right, guys. Looks like our XVS has shown up. It's only a f only took five minutes for this transfer, which you know, it's pretty funny considering how long it takes to transfer stuff around on the ERC twenty. Maybe this is why Binance Coin is doing so well. Not too sure, but anyway, our uh, twelve and a quarter XVS showed up. And we are super stoked, ready for the airdrop. And if you just want to double check real quick that it's on your address, you just give that a little refresh and there we go. There's our Venus. So anyway, guys, thanks for tuning in. We really appreciate it. I hope you learned how to transfer assets from an existing Binance wallet into your new Binance chain wallet. So if you guys have any questions, please comment below, like, subscribe, and remember, let the market come to you. It's gonna be a beautiful week.